The Power of Propaganda, written by Max Black. Germany was once considered the most enlightened and advanced nation on earth. It attracted and hosted the brightest minds from around the world. Less than a generation later, they were exterminating entire races of people in industrialized death camps. What the fuck happened? Propaganda happened. Propaganda brainwashed one of the most progressive countries in the world until it became a frenzied carnival of genocide and oppression and did it seemingly overnight. The propaganda that did this wasn't sophisticated, intelligent, or even logical. On the contrary, it was intentionally dumb, nonsensical, and simple. The most successful propaganda always is. That's how a bunch of bleach blonde clones talking about fake news 24-7 managed to turn the most powerful nation in the world into an anti-science theocracy. You see, propaganda only needs two things to succeed. Repetition and saturation. You need to repeat your lie so often that everyone absorbs it. Then you need to saturate the population with your propaganda until all opposing voices are drowned out and silenced. Then you wait for your population to become brainwashed. And boom! You can turn an otherwise rational nation into unquestioning sycophants. The whole point of propaganda is power. You start by deflecting your own accountability onto a powerless scapegoat. Then you rally the country behind destroying that scapegoat. By the time people have learnt of the crime, they have also learnt that they are complicit in it. At which point, you own them completely. Nazis targeted Jews to create fascism. Capitalists targeted socialism to create neoliberalism. Corporations targeted renewable energy to monopolize energy markets. You get the idea. So the moral of this story is this. If one hand of your government starts viciously pointing blame at someone, always, always watch what the other hand is doing.